So, Mr. Speaker, today marks the 100th anniversary of the Canadian Cooperative Association, one of this country's largest economic and social movements. From its beginnings in Hamilton, Ontario, the Cooperative Union of Canada was formed to encourage the sharing of, mu of information, mutual self-help and concerted action among Canadian cooperatives. Today there are 8,800 cooperatives and credit unions across the country. Collectively, they have more than 17 million memberships, over $275 billion in assets, and they employ more than 150,000 people. They differ from traditional businesses in that they are owned by the members who use their services. Their history, of course, show they are often formed during difficult economic times, making them as relevant today as they have ever been. Since most co-ops are locally based, they are not only providing jobs, but also generate wealth which remain in the community. Co-ops are without a doubt one of Canada's greatest single success stories. Mr. Speaker, on behalf of all members of the House, congratulations to the Canadian Cooperative Association on this, their 100th anniversary. Here, here. The Honourable Member for Peterborough.